Hey, what's poppin' y'all? It's your boy Andros. Um, spending the night at my friend's house right now, so that's why it looks a little different. Sun's right in my eyes, so that's why I'm squinting so much. And today I want to talk about <clears throat> the fear of failure and uh, how it plagued me so much when I was younger. Um, I'd say maybe since since the beginning of school, I've always been really good at it. I've always done well. I would always ace through all my courses until I got to about sixth grade. That's when we started doing algebra and I actually had to study. I had, um, everything was so easy up until that point for me that I didn't really have to study for anything. So my grades started to drop because I wasn't studying because I wasn't used to it because I didn't need to. So uh, my grades started to drop and then my parents started to scold me, started to punish me for having bad grades. And, um, that and also my teachers uh, publicly uh, humiliating me in front of class. Um, like they literally, I I've got like a 10 on one of my quizzes at one point and my teacher literally grabbed my page, put it in front of the class and said, how can someone be so dumb? And uh, yeah, that shit fucking sucked. Anyways, so that uh, gave me the fear of failure. It made me feel like, oh, wait, hold on. There's a bird on the bird feeder right there. I don't know if y'all can see it. Hey, pretty cute. Shut the fuck up. I'm trying to do a video, dude. <laughs> All right, kidding. Um, where was I? Um, yeah, so that gave me the fear of failure. Um, so punishment from uh, my parents and my teachers made me fear failure. When, in fact, failure is probably the best thing that can happen to you. It's the, probably the best teacher. Um, you get to learn from your mistakes. Um, I'm honestly grateful for all the failures that I've had in my life right now and I'm grateful for the failures that I'm going to have because I will learn from them. Um, that's something that it took 21 years for me to figure out. Um, I used to hate failing. I used to, I, I didn't, I hate, I was so afraid of failing that I wouldn't even try on things. So like my mindset was, oh, if I don't even try, uh, at least I won't be able, won't be able to fail, but that's so dumb because like I would see a missing on my assignments and be like hey that's better than a that's better than a zero it says it just says missing because it wasn't a number but if I had just done what the hell these guys are two what's good buddies oh, whoa dude Jurassic Park had us oh. yo why are they screaming at me okay all right back to what I was saying earlier before I was uh, interrupted by those damn birds, they're, they're just trying to eat some worms or something. They're gone now. Um, I, if I would have just, uh, like, Christmas treed the quiz or something, I probably would have had a higher chance of getting a, a higher score because if missing is the same as a zero, dude. It was, it was pretty dumb of me. Um, that is not how I think anymore. I don't want to do that anymore. I am okay with failing now and because that's how you learn dude uh whenever you fall down you got to get back up and try to do the same try not to do the same thing oh hold on there's some parrots coming uh let me film these two hey buddies pretty cute huh they're kind of green just chilling god i love it i'm so grateful to be out here right now soaking up all the sun with all the nature around me seeing these beautiful birds all right y'all uh, make sure you're working out, doing all that good stuff. I hope this video helps somebody. Please like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. And Andros out. See y'all.